channel welcome back to another vlog i am starting off the vlog very early it is 20 past 8 and it's currently wednesday now i do have a video that you guys will see on thursday if you're watching it you already seen that video that cook with me and i do have an appointment to go and get my toes done however i'm not really feeling that vibe so i might cancel it or i might go i don't know but we shall see also i have an appointment on tomorrow which is thursday to thread my eyebrows but for now let's make breakfast and let me talk to you guys about this whoever came up with this idea you guys are a genius and you've probably seen this already because it's all over tiktok and there's all different types of recipe to it but it's basically oats smoothie and i have like um some oats in my cupboard that you know it's been there for a while and i feel bad for it and i don't really like oatmeal as such like warm oatmeal looking at recipes to use the oats one particular recipe that i saw on on youtube i can't even remember all the channel to you know show them out but they basically took like half cup of oats to like a cup of milk pour it in the blender and add one banana for sweetener so if you don't like bananas you can add honey and they basically blend that up or you, and you can also add peanut butter like you can do all the variation of this oat smoothie and i did it but my take on it i did half cup of oats a cup of milk i added cinnamon and nutmeg i added one banana and i also added some protein powder vanilla protein powder and oh my god it was so good it tastes so effing good and i also added a little bit of ice to it and it tastes so good so i wanted to recreate it with yogurt because i do have some yogurt that's about to expire or i don't know if it's already expired but even if yogurt is expired you can still use it like Hell no. No, no. Like a week or two weeks up up to expiry date because it's shelf life and either way yogurt is um is already curd milk don't take that advice uh, that's just what i do <laughs> so don't be eating expired yogurt and then get sick and blame me and say you saw it on my videos if the thing expired toss it out that's just what i do using vanilla yogurt i also have strawberry yogurt so, oh no, this is coconut yogurt. So I'm using coconut yogurt. And I also have strawberry yogurt. So if, if you want like a strawberry or smoothie uh, type of situation, you can add some frozen strawberry, do your strawberry yogurt, add your oats, your milk, and your little flavorings. And it's so good. So let me set you guys up here and show you guys. Alright guys, so these are all the ingredients you're going to need. However, if you don't have yogurt, you can omit the yogurt and just add a banana for sweetness or you can add honey if you don't like bananas, right? So the basic that you're going to need is oats, you're going to need milk. I usually use almond milk, but I'm out of almond milk, so I'm using this um, a little fat milk. I have cinnamon as well as nutmeg and I just put some ice in here and I also have my coconut yogurt so if you don't have the yogurt forget about a yogurt you just use half cup of the oats to a cup of milk if you want add some ice and add your basic cinnamon nutmeg and some honey for sweetness also one more thing that I'm gonna add to that is my protein um drink from herbalife so i'm gonna add one scoop of my protein powder to this again if you don't have protein powder it's okay that's just an added step but you can do it with the basic oats milk cinnamon ice and whatever form of sweetness if you like maple syrup or if you like um, honey or if you want to add some sugar in there i mean it's up to you so yeah 
that's basically it if, so this is a base for you to create whatever flavor you want if you want to do like a peanut butter smoothie type of situation you can add peanut butter to here um almond butter if you want to do like a cacao chocolate oat smoothie add in your cacao powder or your cocoa powder to this so this is just really the the foundation for you to create whatever type of oat smoothie you like we start to get mixing before my eyes melt this is the oats that i'm using better living instant oats so i'm doing half cup of oats be a cup some cinnamon I love a lot of nutmeg so I'm gonna add a lot of nutmeg Ooh, oh my god I think that was way too much and I'm also gonna add my protein powder again you don't have to add this if you don't have it And last, I'm gonna add some coconut yogurt. That's about three tablespoon. The lid on. So this is what it looks like. Time for the taste test. Mmm. Oh my god. This is so good. Mm-hmm. This tastes amazing. This is so delicious. I must say. You're tasting the oats, you're tasting this nutmeg i thought i added too much nutmeg but i didn't it was perfect you are tasting the yogurt a little bit the protein powder if you want um this is this is not very sweet as is if you want it to be more sweet just add some almond butter honey whatever but i prefer it like this and you can also add a little bit of vanilla extract mm -hmm. mm such a healthy quick smoothie mm -hmm. so i'm gonna finish my breakfast and i'll check back with you guys in a bit okay guys so it's several hours since you last seen that clip i end up canceling my appointment for today and i'm gonna do it tomorrow because i'm not feeling too well i'm not sick or anything it's just that time of the month now so i'm just gonna cook up some lunch i'm gonna make like some black eye peas with vegetables and basmati rice i'm gonna make everything in one like a pilau but it's not really like a pilau well it's like a veggie pilau kind of thing i'm gonna do that and oh my god my stomach is hurting so let me show you guys what i have going on here okay, guys so my rice is finished from this container and i usually buy my rice in price mat so i buy this big pack of basmati rice this vacuum seal and it's like honestly it feels hard like cement a bag of rice like this usually lasts dean and i maybe like a year yeah because um when i do cook rice i only cook a cup of rice for him and i and 
his parents, they didn't really like the basmati. They like the regular rice. But Dan and I love the basmati. So Dan, he don't carry lunch or breakfast. So he buy a lunch at work. He skip breakfast. Yeah, and so he buys lunch at work. And when he come home in the evening, like he either have what I made for lunch, for dinner, or I'll make something else. We'll make something else for dinner. Or sometimes his mom will bring across food and like that. So usually a bag of rice like this lasts a year because if I'm cooking rice like today, I'm only gonna cook like a cup of rice and then I cook half a cup of rice and that lasts me two days. It's just me alone eating rice. So yeah, and it's a good investment. I can't remember how much we pay for it, but it's like a hundred and forty or hundred and fifty dollars somewhere around there so i'm gonna make up a quick little lunch i wouldn't be recording this because it's nothing fancy it's just black eyed peas with basmati rice and vegetables all boiling one just like a pilau and my stomach is hurting so i'll catch you guys in a little bit all right guys so i just opened it just to show you guys so i need to use some of this but this is what it looks like as you can see it is sealed usually we used to buy the same brand the same brown rice and it had a zip which was way better than this because now when you open the bag you have to make sure and seal it properly or store it in a container like what I'm gonna do here so that's the annoying thing that they switch from the zip and they just put this annoying thing which I hate so I'm now gonna empty it into my container this is what it looks like it is vacuum seal it is so heavy oh my god so this is what it looks like so i'm gonna pour it into my container all right guys so this is my quick lunch there is cauliflower uh, black eye corn peas carrots all of that good stuff in there celery side broccoli well you can't really see because everything just like melt up in one but this is my lunch so i already cut it off but i want to taste it for the seasoning Oh my god. Perfection. Perfection. Alright guys, so I have my lunch in my little bowl here. I just cut up some cucumber. So I'm gonna eat this. Mm, so hot. So I'm gonna eat this and watch some YouTube videos, drink some hot tea, and just relax. So I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.